The UNM football team kicked off the regular season last night, but an untimely error and a key injury proved to be way too much for the Lobos to overcome. KOAT Action 7 Sports Director Orlando Sanchez has your more in the morning. Look at sports. Good morning, everyone. Lobo Nation football is back, but there were plenty of questions with this year's team. Could a defense that gave up an average of 42 points a game improve? How would the offense look after losing key linemen and a star running back? Could quarterback Cole Gauchy stay healthy this season? Well, last night, some of those questions were answered. Official attendance 25,802. The Miners' Piñata was not included in the total. After a UTEP touchdown, Lobos respond. Cole Gauchy taking things into his own hands, and he makes the UTEP D pay. Gauchy, 68 yards to the crib. He finished with 184 on the ground to go along with two touchdowns. But the New Mexico defense didn't show up in the first half. The Miners were up 24 to 7 at the end of the half. UNM was a different team. Second time around, Lobos call it a comeback. They tie it up at 24. But the bad news, folks, Gauchy comes up limping on a run. He would not return to the game. Coach Davey says it's his hamstring. We roll to the fourth quarter, and here's a pivotal moment in the game. Off the punt return, Damian Gamblin, no! Fumbles around the five-yard line. UTEP would cash in, and that's the difference. The Lobos dropped their season opener by the final count of 31-24. to you know, we're 0-1. Uh, we've got Arizona State coming in next week. But more important than that, we've got to, we've got to improve. So I'm disappointed, um, you know, but I'm not discouraged. We just have to get better. Let's take a look at the numbers. And surprise, surprise, the Lobos were effective running the rock, chalking up 410 yards on the ground. New Mexico completed only five out of nine passes. The difference, though, turnovers. UTEP took care of the ball, had zero. UNM coughed it up three times, two fumbles, and one interception. Well, that's going to do it for your more in the morning look at sports. Have a great day. All right, thanks a lot, Orlando. And hey, we've got another game at the lab this afternoon. Yeah, we go from football yesterday to baseball today. Why not? And it's the second to last game at the lab. So check it out. First pitch, 91 degrees. It's going to be hot. It will be breezy to windy, too. 84 for that last out, that first pitch at 6.05 this evening. Root on the Topes to a victory.